An increase in what police call street racing has led to new laws allowing law enforcement to confiscate some vehicles in Texas. Kayla Brown is here in the studio with more on what's happening. Kayla? Carolyn, the law took effect in Texas in September. Not only can vehicles be seized, but the charge of a Class B misdemeanor can also increase. House Bill 2315 went into effect on September 1st, including in it the ability for law enforcement to seize vehicles involved in street racing. Street racing is defined as the exhibition of acceleration between each other and comes after law enforcement saw a rise in street racing in recent years. It's always been in, uh, vehicles that are going out there in competition mode, but it's, it seems to in recent years become a bigger deal. Locally, just in the past week, San Angelo police have arrested two drivers for street racing and nine arrests between February and August of this year. The Texas Department of Public Safety says this is a Class B misdemeanor, but if there are injuries or death involved, the charge increases. Laws are present now to make sure that people are not out there racing each other, and if they are found in violation of it, you're going to be one stop, two, you're going to be arrested because that is now a Class B misdemeanor. Now, if people end up getting hurt, Obviously, the punishment is going to be increased. Uh, it goes to Class A misdemeanor and then forfeiture of, of property. And Texas lawmakers approved House Bill 2315 in June. And though the San Angelo Police Department has made multiple arrests, they haven't yet seized any vehicles from the bill. For News Connection, I'm Kayla Brown.